Hello. This week we are going to start a new math unit on money. So the first thing we're going to be talking about is a small coin called a penny. And a penny is a circle and it's the only brown coin. So on the front we see President Abraham Lincoln and then on the back of the old pennies, we see this is called the Lincoln Memorial, and it says one cent. If you look at a new penny, the front looks the same. This is a new penny, and this is the old penny, and both of the fronts look the same. But if you look at the back of the new penny, it's upside down, it has a shield that says one cent. So if you're looking at new and old pennies, you can see they look a little different on the back, but if it's brown and you see President Lincoln on the front, then you know that it's a penny. Now, a pe all coins have a value and a penny is only worth one cent. So when we talk about coins, we talk about cents. And if you see Mrs. Carmody drawing the coins, I'll usually draw a circle with a P in the middle of it, and that means penny. The other type of coin we're going to talk about today is called a nickel. And the nickel has a president on the head side, and heads means front. So on the penny, on the head side, it's President Abraham Lincoln. And on the, on the nickel, the head side is President Thomas, Thomas Jefferson. So the nickel, like the penny, also got has a update. So if you see a nickel that has President Jefferson to the side or in the center, both of those are a nickel. Now the tails are the back side has Thomas Jefferson's house on the back of it. So that's where he lived. So both of the tails on the nickel are the same, but the heads are a little bit different. Now nickels are medium sized coin and a nickel is worth five cents. So if you see Mrs. Carmody drawing a circle with an N inside of it, that means it's a nickel. All right, so today what you're gonna be working on, on your math sheet, is you're gonna be matching a penny and a nickel's heads and tails. So you're gonna look at the, oh, sorry about that. You're gonna look at the head, and you're gonna match it to the tail, which is the back of the front. The front and the back is what you wanna match them. The other part that you're gonna be doing today is you're gonna see something that looks, it looks kinda of like this. There's a bunch of coins all over the place. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna count how many pennies and how many nickels there are. And if you remember, a penny is the brown one. So let's count how many pennies. We have one, two, three, four. So next to the, coins are running away. So next to the P, we are gonna write the number four. Give me one second. So next to the P, we're gonna write four. Now we're gonna count the number of nickels. So we have one, two, three, four nickels also. So on your math sheet, you're gonna be looking to see how many nickels and how many pennies. And that's what we're gonna work on today. All right. Good luck and let me know if you need any help.